Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, I'm back at it again with another Call of Duty video. Now, guys, as promised, I maxed out the Bullfrog SMG. Now, guys, this class setup is the ultimate SMG class in the game right now. It's better than MP5, better than AK-74U, better than whatever gun you guys are using. Yo, when it comes to firepower, this gun is a two-shot in-game, and it gives me so many multi-kills when it comes to in-game, from aiming down sight, the sprint speed time, and... Even the how much rounds are in the magazine, this gun has it all. So let's go into the gunsmith to give you guys the best class setup of this weapon. Okay, guys, so starting off with the muzzle, I do have the Spetnaz Compensator. So the Spetnaz Compensator actually gives me 12% vertical recoil control. And then it does take out 8% of the horizontal recoil control. That's perfectly fine, guys, because even with the minus 8% of the horizontal recoil control, I barely see a difference. This gun has little to no recoil whatsoever. It is the most overpowered submachine gun. It's like a mini LMG with no recoil, guys. It just mows anything and everything down in game. So, guys, use a spent house compensator. I promise you guys, you guys won't be upset. Okay, now this is in every one of my class setup, guys. I try to use other under barrels, but I always come back to finding the red cell foregrip is the best foregrip for the gun. It gives you five plus sprinting move speed and then 30 melee quickness, guys. So this is honestly the best under barrel, the best foregrip in the game so far. I used everything. If you guys want to use a Spetnaz speed grip, go ahead. I honestly prefer the red cell foregrip. That's what I'm used to, and that is what I do good with. Okay, guys, so this is no ordinary SMG. It already comes off the bat stock factory with 50 rounds in the mag. So smack the VDV 85 round fast mag on it, and it absolutely tears and mows people down. The amounts of multi kills you guys are going to get in Nuketown 84 is insane when you guys use this 80 round fast mag. It gives you guys 70% on the max starting ammo, ammo capacity, and magazine ammo capacity capacity with 40% reload quickness while it does take away some of your aim down sight speed that is perfectly fine because we're going to boost that up with the other attachments we have on this gun 85 rounds in a mag guys this is a small lmg with little to no recoil it just absolutely melts the left right and center okay guys so for the handle i find that the airborne elastic wrap and the Groot elastic wrap whatever gun it's on is always the best one the elastic wraps are always insane because it does give 30% aim down sight speed and also 90% flinch resistance. So that means when you're getting shot at, you're not going to be flinching as much. So your bullets aren't going to be missing the opponent or missing your enemy if you have this elastic wrap on. So I think the Gru elastic wrap is the best handle for this SMG right now in the game. Okay, guys, last but not least, it is the KGB skeletal stock. Now, I used every stock in this setup right now. And I found that the skeletal stock was insane. While it does give me 30% of the sprints of fire time, I am a running gun type player, so I am sprinting a lot. And then when someone pops out the corner, I have to shoot them automatically on sight. So it gives me that sprints of fire time. It just absolutely works wonders when it comes to this weapon. It does give away 30% of the hit fire accuracy, but that's okay because we're not going around hit firing anything and everything in the map. So that is perfectly fine, guys. And now every class I have this. I have the perk greed for the wild card. And then I am running flag jack attack mask, scavenger and tracker, and then ghost and ninja, guys. I always run that in every one of my classes. And it's just something I like to do because I am a running gun type player. So I don't want to be caught lacking when I'm on those high end kill streaks. And then, of course, I have the stun and semtex grenades. I have the field mic. And then, of course, guys, I have that plague diamond spaz. 12 this spaz 12 works wonders i want to show you guys this setup i have for the spaz 12 because it is a two shot to the chest shot it to the body you already know what it is when it comes to the muzzle we have the infantry v choke for the spaz 12 barrel is the 24.6 ranger but actually switch that over to the 24.8 task force and look at that firepower guys it is insane going on to the magazine size and the magazine normally i run the stanag 12 round tube so that's what we're going to put on right now also guys we have the airborne elastic wrap for this spaz 12 it gives the same thing as the Gru elastic wrap i'm telling you guys this elastic wrap is hands down the best handle for any gun whatever the case may be and then guys i have the wire stock now i could go for the marathon stock but i want to choose the wire stock because it doesn't take away from the accuracy at all when it comes to this gun the Spence of Fire Time is a plus 10% one. You guys have this wire stock. So guys, try this gun out. Try the Spaz 12. Combine it with the mini, L the mini LMG, aka the Bullfrog. And you guys are going to be pulling 100 plus kill games on Nuketown 84. If you guys enjoyed and want to see more classic set of videos like this, 
honestly, I'm excited. I want to see what you guys do in game. Let me know in the comment section below. Is this class working wonders for you guys in Nuketown 84? Are you guys pulling those 100 plus kill games like I am? Honestly, this class is insane. So guys, without further ado, it's me, boy, Alan. You like, favorite, subscribe. You guys haven't ready to be updated in all the best and latest Call of Duty videos when it comes to tips and tricks on how to upgrade and improve your multiplayer gameplay and zombies gameplay. This is a channel beyond. Join the Waffle Nation, guys. It's been your boy, Alan Azim, and I'll catch you guys in my next Call of Duty video. We out of here. Peace.